Well, he's been fighting crime for almost 80 years. Now Detective Dick Tracy forever guards the Riverwalk. The latest addition to the Century Walk honors Pulitzer Prize winning cartoonist and longtime Naperville resident Dick Loker, bringing a larger than life statue of Loker's famous comic strip hero to the city. NCTV 17's Kevin Maycheck has the story. Dick Tracy landed by the Riverwalk just behind the township building on Tuesday, April 6th. But local fans were held in suspense until Sunday, April 11th. When Pulitzer Prize winning cartoonist Dick Loker finally revealed the famed detective to the public. Oh, it's just like breathtaking. It's, it's so cool. This is magnificent. This is a wonderful piece of artwork. This is great. It's like the culmination of his career. I mean, he's done a lot of great things and I'm very proud of him. The Century Walk purchased the fedora wearing crime fighter for almost $150,000. It's the 35th piece added to their collection of art in the downtown area. This is what we're calling our signature piece. There are people from all over the world who recognize Dick Tracy. So what did it take to make this nine and a half foot tall bronze statue? 600 pounds of clay to start with, an inspiration and a dream. And for Loker, that dream began in 1957 when he became assistant to Dick Tracy creator Chester Gould. At 80 years old, he continues writing and drawing the comic in his Naperville home. I'm the luckiest cartoonist in the world. I work for a legend who created an icon and doesn't get any better than that. And to continue his statement, let's make crime pay. <laughs> Reporting from the Riverwalk, Kevin Maycheck, Naperville News 17. Artist Don Reed collaborated with Dick Loker to build the statue at the River's Edge Foundry in Beloit, Wisconsin.